guys welcome back so in today's video i'm going to be reacting to another song by elaine duran this one was the one this this one i've been getting quite a bit it's her cover of because you loved me by celine dion um it says because you loved me with a twist so i don't know what that means i don't know what she's going to be doing but i'm really excited so let's just jump into this reaction For all those times you stood for me For all the truth that you made me see For all the joy you brought to my life For all the wrong that you made right For every dream you made come true For all the love I found in you I'll be forever Really quick i'm really glad that she said love like love because in this song celine dion <laughs> this is sort of an inside joke between me and my sister-in-law but celine sometimes when she sings the word love it comes out love and she does that in this song a light in the dark shining your love into my life celine says shining your love into my life it comes out love when she sings that line so i'm i'm glad and i know and I've heard people cover this song and stuff like on singing shows and like on YouTube and I don't know if they are just trying to like pay homage to Celine by singing it that way but it's just say love don't try to say love it you know like just say love <laughs> I can listen to Celine Dion when she says love but when other people who say love every other time you know like love sing this song and then they come out at this one spot in the entire song and they say love i don't know why but it just gets on my nerves <laughs> so thank you elaine for singing love and not love you've been my inspiration I was not expecting a whistle note. I was expecting like, I don't know. I don't know what I thought she was gonna do, but I didn't think a whistle was coming out of her. Oh man, that was so pretty. a pretty run I like her I like how she decides to sing certain words like that the way she sang me 
it just came out so different than what I'm used to hearing. I'm gonna hear it again. I just like it, it sounds so pretty. She's fabulous. So is she like well known there or is she sort of like an underdog as far as musicians go? Because I've heard her I've heard her name like in the requests and stuff, but not as much as some other people. So I was just I'm just curious if um so is she not as well known in the Philippines or is she just kind of like the underdog when it comes to female singers there? She's, oh, she's good. I like her. I was not expecting a whistle, guys. Did y'all do that on purpose and not tell me that she can whistle? Because I felt, I feel set up <laughs> in a good way. This is a song um, I, I was very familiar with. It was, it was on Celine Dion's Falling Into You album from 1996. Um, I believe it is track two on the, on the album. It was one of my favorites. It was one of my first CDs I ever bought. It was written by the famous Diane Warren, who is like, she's one of the best songwriters here in America. She has written many, many, many love songs that I'm sure y'all know, um, including this one. She also wrote I Turn To You by Christina Aguilera slash All For One, who originally did it on the Space Jam soundtrack. She also wrote I Don't Wanna Miss A Thing by Aerosmith. She, she's written so many songs. Like, I'm sure y'all know at least 10 songs of hers that she's written. I remember seeing an interview of her on, I think, like 2020 or something uh, when I was, like, 12. Because I just, I loved her so much. Um, oh, also, um, because I'm a Selena fan, she also wrote I'm Getting Used to You, which is on Selena's Dreaming of You album. But I remember seeing an interview with her, and she has a room with a piano and cassette tapes. Some of them are unfinished, some of them are finished, but she is like, says she's needing to tweak them still. But she has this room just full of cassette tapes just everywhere of songs she's written. And um, I forget who the interviewer was, but they were asking her, you know, why she's never married, why, you know, why she's stayed single all of her life. And she said she's just never fallen in love. And she, and the, the interviewer said, well, that's odd because you write love songs. And she said, well, I'm, I'm in love with music. And I remember the interviewer asking her about a few of the songs she's written, like, well, who inspired this? What inspired that? Blah, 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 blah. And they come around to this song and she says, uh, because you loved me by Celine Dion. Who's that? Who, who inspired that? Who's that about? And Diane Warren said that it's about her dad, which I thought was so sweet. I, I've I've always liked this song and I like I like Elaine's version. I like her cover. I think she did a really good job. She made it her own with sticking to like the original feel of the song, if that makes sense. Um she does little runs in in really, really good places. That whistle though <sighs> was not ready. So now that I know that she does that, I'm gonna be like waiting to see if she does it again and I didn't see I didn't see any evidence of any kind of vocal stress vocal strain uh or anything like that uh as she was singing this the song seems to fit in her range where she's most comfortable um so there wasn't any there didn't seem to be any like stress on her vocal cords which is good because this song is pretty high it's pretty and it's hard it's kind of a hard song to sing but she did really, really well. And I love, I love her little vocalizations she decides to do, especially how she just ended it. I just, I just like it so much. It was so pretty. She might have to get her own playlist too. So that's been it for this video. If you like these kinds of videos where I react to things, please hit the subscribe button. Don't forget to hit the notification bell to be notified when I have new videos coming out and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.